Hello guys, it's my pleasure today. I want to talk to you and I want to teach you on how you can download objects from the website and how you can save those objects into your desktop and on how you can import those objects from your desktop to your ArchCAD bedded library. So this is the this is the procedure I shall use. There's this website I like using. I like using the Archibase 3D objects. It's a website I actually download my objects from. So just come and click the first link. Yeah, in this link we have categories. We have so many objects here. So you just come to category. Then you just click on this arrow here. Then you choose which objects you feel like downloading. You have the home appliances, industrial, ships and vessels, and most. It has all the objects that you need. So let me use. I want to download and show you now. I can download gates and fences. If there's someone who just asked me to show him on, our, on where and how I usually download my objects, and especially the gate. So just come and click filter. So from there, these are my objects. You have one to twelve. You can just decide on if you on page one. You see, there's no object that is pleasing you. You can just click on page two, page three to twelve, and select the type of object you want to download. For instance, let me download this one. So just click there just come and click downloads here is going to take me to this saving option I'm going to save this as my get then let me put this want to save it mark a so I'll just click save and wait for it to download so this get as Contains a space of that 1.9 megabytes. So just give it time to download. It's going to download in a zip format. So we are going to extract it before you import it to ArchCAD. I'm going to show you how we're going to extract it. And now we are going to import it. So as it continue downloading, you can also go back select another type of object to download so for instance let me say I want to download uh, street stars I'll click filter then I come here so So I want to download. Let me go to page five. See what is there. Mm. Let me say I want to download this bench. Just click down bench. Click downloads. Save uh, save this as bench. I want to save one mark A, click download. Let's go back and download another object. So I'll go to category there. Download me. Let me say I want to download some flowers. So click filter. Just come and download. Let me pick one item or object I want to download. For instance, I'll download this one. I'll click this. Come here to downloads. Uh, let me save this as house plant. And save it on Mac. Yeah, I'll click save. So I just need to download and complete. So I can go back again. Select again the type of object you want to download. For instance, let's go to beds. 
click filter yeah i'm going to select the type of bed i want to download let's say i want to download this one here just come and click downloads save it as bed click save go back let me say i want to download some thing dealing with uh, with the office of equipment so click filter so let me say i want to download uh, uh, the monitor just come and click there the type of object i want to download then i click download then i'll save monitor click save so just wait for i want to use these ones as an example I'll show you now i'm going to import them into the arch code embedded library so you can just decide there are many websites that contain free arch card objects you can choose the best website that you see it's good for you so with me i like using the archbase planet it's my best website for downloading my best objects for architectural drawings it has unlimited objects so that's why i like using it at some point usually contains some limitations so there are those minimum objects that you can download per day you can download all the object ones so for the other times usually it does to limit the number of objects to download but you can download all the objects every day regarding the type of object you want to download so I'll just wait for the downloader complete yeah good so just come back go to my desktop to go to my desktop on my laptop these are the objects that i've already downloaded so let's start with the bed i want to extract this I'll just click extract uh, let me take that one there bench the same click it there we have another bed oh, I think this is the same same bed that I've already downloaded or oh, I'm not wrong so I'll just come to get click on get uh, house plant and right here, there of the monitor yeah I want to use these objects as you can see this is my bed I'm going to show you now you are going to both these objects going to show you now you're going to import these objects into the archcad embedded library this is my bed that i already downloaded from the arch base planet so okay for instance if you want to open your plant this is the preview of your plant so I'm going, let me show you now you're going to import these objects from the desktop into the archcad embedded library so i just come and open my archcad using article 25 so for instance let me open one of the drawings that I just done and show you the objects I'm talking about
and yeah, so this is a project that I done today. This is a project I did today. So if you can see, it, I have my gate here. Yeah, this gate I just downloaded from the website that I've already shown you. The Arch card. The I mean the Arch base planet. Yeah, as you can see, it's awesome. So I'm going to show you now on how you are going to board these objects into your arch card and I are going to use them in your drawings. So this is just uh, my design road. It's a carriageway of seven meters which has 3.5 with it by 3.5 with a center line of a yellow line with a thickness of 100 millimeters so this is just another part of the design that i'm not going to talk about it today so here just come to objects so you see i have these gates here I uh, just want to show you and I can import them so that they can just come and fix themselves in the middle of the library. So just come and down here, click on download other objects. There's a video I did earlier about this, but just it was just a rough read. It was not containing all the details that I wanted to talk about. So it's just the same process. So if you want to bolt the bed, just come and click bed. Wait for it to then click open. Then it will load for takes time depending on the size that the object contains as you can see it has already fixed itself here so you're not going to download it from the from the edge card objects so you're just going to come and if you want to use this bed for design just come to embedded library just choose the object that you wish to use so next let me show you how you can import now the bench just the same process just click there click open wait for it to load Yeah, I have my bench here. Just same process. Same process. Come to our gate. Have this gate. Yeah, it has already fixed itself there. Which is, I think there's another one object that I have not imported. my bed already my bench my gate don't think whether there is any other that I've left aside there's this house plant so I'm just come and click there click open wait for it to load And there we go. For instance, I want to use this flower. I mean this this plant lemon here. Well, let me use the one that I've already bought. This one. I want to use it in my design. So I just come and choose this. Then I'm going to 
to do some small settings so my offset I just pressed my offset to be negative 300 so I just count my 2d let's say I want to put that flower here or that plant here just come and place it there like that then another one you can just also come and place it there just want to drag it upwards misbehaving or I can just drag a copy of it to be uniform horizontally like that so I've got your 3d so here's your plant is the flower that I just downloaded it from my arch base planet website it's just simple like that thank you now don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more updates and for more designs